section E problem 2 we can start from sketching the front plane and extrude it then we can cut these features these three cuts from the side so let's start catch on the front plane and make the circle at the bottom this is 20 then we can add a center line over here another circle which is same as this one so we can put equal constraint and the distance between them is given as 100 now we can start with sketching the contour so we can start from here Let's add the constraint. This circle would be concentric with this one, and this one would be concentric with this one. Now let's start adding the dimensions. This distance is given as 20. The radius for this is 25. This radius is 10. And this angle is given 30. This is 45. This is 30. Let's check if everything is tangent. We can make this tangent. So now this is left. We can we have to constrain this point with this one. Make horizontal. Because this is in the same line as shown in the figure. Now we can select everything and mirror. This point we can constrain again this one too so everything is constrained now we can go to extrude remember to extrude from the mid plane extrusion is 45 mm now let's go to the right plane now as shown from the side view we have to make the contours here that we need to cut first of all let's add a center line let's add the features that we need to cut close the sketch give the dimensions and this is 65 this is 12 the radius is 25 so this is done you can select it and the center line and mirror now again you can start sketching from here make a tangent with this line now add the dimensions this distance is given 25 the height 
is 92 this radius is 10 so everything is constrained we can mirror left these and mirror about the center now we can go to extrude cut through all both we need to select and ok this is done now the last thing is to add chamfers the chamfer there are four chamfers of 5 mm to so select the edges Now that one, you can zoom in to select properly. The four edges are selected and done. Now let's apply the material. This is titanium Pi8MN. Titanium alloys Pi8MN. Any apply. Let's check the mass. 1071.13 let's check with the answer 1071.13 so the answer is correct next part in the next video thank you